So hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. This is gonna be another content vlog. Um, but <laughs> well, straight off the bat, like just getting into it, my mood is like not there. I don't know why that is. I think it's because I'm on my period, honestly, because every time I'm on my period, I'm like extra hormonal and extra like emotional and stuff like that, so. I think that's the reason why but like i don't feel like taking pictures i'm going because obviously you know i have to be consistent i have to be consistent and um i have an accountability partner so it's like i can't let her down as well bethany if you're watching <laughs> but um I will, it would be a lie for me to like come on here all smiley talking about some hey guys we're gonna go take pictures today because today I don't feel like it I don't it's it snowed outside I feel like ugly today <laughs> but I just wanted to come on here and tell you guys like you're not gonna feel like taking pictures every day lately I just been feeling like imposter syndrome like a very bad case of imposter syndrome like i acknowledge the growth that i've had thus far but it's like i guess the more you're growing it's like okay well when am i gonna get to this point okay i'm gonna like figure myself out and then come back on camera and like rant some more because i have more things to say to you all can i place you guys right here hey this is my outfit. Okay, we're gonna talk. Can we talk for a minute? Don't mind my thing, but um, I just wanna talk to you guys because like I said earlier, like I just don't feel like I'm not in the mood. Like, <laughs> like it's actually so crazy because some days I'm so excited to like get ready, you know, put my outfits together and then like take pictures. Today was not like that. Yesterday, I was usually I plan my outfits the day before. When I tell you yesterday, like I was just in my bed crying the whole time. I was just like miserable. I don't know what was wrong with me. I just kept crying. I was just sad. I took out my cornrows like a couple days ago and I've been needing to wash it so I can like, you know, redo my cornrows or whatever. And when I tell you I had no motivation to do it, like, and yesterday was like the last day I could have done it because obviously content day is today. And I still didn't do it. Like, <laughs> I had no motivation to wash my hair and cornrow it. I just literally slicked it back. So if my head looks even big, like right here, y'all hear that? It's just a big poof. Because I had no motivation to do my hair, I also had no motivation to paint my toenails. Like, literally, I based my outfit on having to wear closed toe shoes just so I don't feel the need to paint my toenails. And I'm just like, what is wrong with me? Like, I just don't feel like doing it. And it's so crazy because like Bethany, I was talking to her yesterday and she was feeling weird too. Both of us have been feeling weird. Like both of us have not been wanting to post our pictures when like we, you know, need to post our pictures. And it's just like, what is going on? Like, I, this, is, this is not it. But um, nevertheless, here I am dressed up again. I hope you don't see my nipple. <laughs> um, Cause this shirt is see-through. I wanted to um, show you guys. I seen this TikTok from, you know, a mutual content creator. His name is Aaron. His video that he posted the other day really like just resonated with, resonated with me because uh, it was just like summed up everything that I was feeling, honestly. I'm gonna put it on the screen, right, but. I just always put in a sound over my videos or something like that. So like for my get ready with me's, my outfit of the days, fit checks, whatever, I'm gonna try to start talking more. But I'm mainly making this video today to just address my concerns and to get what's been sitting on my chest like for the past months i would say and i was just recently inspired after watching josh Ohms's video about him being a full-time content creator and everything that comes within that but let's talk about the people trying to get to that level and what it takes to even consider having a career like that so obviously i'm a black male content creator and specifically my niche is fashion and it's just so many things that come with that that I'm not going to say I wasn't prepared for.
but that people wanting to pursue this industry aren't necessarily prepared for. You know, it'll be days I just try to put on an outfit to go take pictures, and my parents are like, why are you out so long? Like, why are you taking so many pictures? Like, what is this doing? Like, what are you trying to pursue here? Like, you're... And it's funny, okay, I'm gonna pause it, but it's funny he mentioned his parents. I feel like now I'm at a point where my mom doesn't really care, per se, where I go. Um, I mean, she does ask, but she doesn't really like, oh, like, why are you doing this? She doesn't care. Or maybe she just doesn't know. <laughs> so that I'm lucky in that aspect, but I will ask that question to myself. So you know how he was like, you know, his parents would be like, why are you doing this? Like, what are you pursuing? I literally, my, I will have like, so my brain will have that conversation with myself when I'm like getting ready, like in the back of my head, I'm just like, why are you doing this? Why are you going out to pursue this? Why, why, why stay home? Like you're not, do find something else. Like this is not for you. This is not your career path, blah, blah, blah. And I'm just like, why do I have those thoughts? Like I, it drives me crazy, honestly. And that's why I said, I don't know if it's like imposter syndrome. It's like it's trying to keep me down and trying to keep me from actually pursuing what I want to pursue because I feel like I'm never going to be that person. But it's just, I've been having a lot of those thoughts lately and it's uneasy. It's not a nice feeling, obviously. It's like added anxiety and I just, I, I don't need that right now. College student. And let me just say this, I am a full-time college student pursuing a degree that I honestly feel like I'm going to do nothing with, but we'll save that topic for another day. And it's like, all I want to do is pursue making content, but the tireless hours, um, all the fits I have to plan, all the location scouting I have to do, all the people that I even try to hit up to take pictures of myself, because I'm not going to lie, let's be honest, the tripod is not always your best friend. And I'm just sitting here thinking and reflecting about my life because I go back to school on Monday. And okay, let me pause right there. But yeah, like what he was saying, like you guys, I've mentioned this before. Like a lot of people see people, you know, take pictures on Instagram. Um, and you might think, oh, as okay, I'm speaking from the point of view as like a content creator or an influencer, so, or at least someone trying to be one. When you already are an influencer, it's kind of easier. I'm not gonna say that it's still not hard, but I definitely feel like you have more resources to um, you know, create the content you wanna create, wherever you wanna create it, all that stuff. But um, I feel like when you're trying to get to that position, it can be very taxing on your physical and mental because it's like, I know for me, and I don't know if I'm like talking or going out, going down a rabbit hole, but like I know for me, like I have, there's like this added pressure. There's like this added pressure where I feel like, let me place you guys right here. Okay. There's like this added pressure for me. And I feel like if I don't have like the most fire fit, like if my fit isn't like, you know, not basic, I'm not going to take a picture because it's like no one's going to like that. I feel like people expect so much more from like me and if I don't deliver then it's like what are you doing type thing. But I guess it's just a constant reminder that you know stop thinking like that. That's only limiting yourself. But let's continue watching his video. I wrote out an entire schedule for myself for the next few months just because I know that this is what I want and that consistency is going to get me to where I want to be. And even with a small following like I have, I have less than 5,000 followers on all my platforms and my YouTube doesn't even have 200 subscribers, but I'm not even a YouTuber for real. So I'm going to leave that out. And to organically grow your following, it's difficult. Like, there's so many people who make the same videos as you. And for me, being a black content creator, I'm just going to speak on me being black. It's harder for me to blow up. It's harder for me to get the recognition I deserve. It's harder for me to get these opportunities. Because all you see on your For You page is white content creators. Like, let's be honest. And I'm not here to bash them or say anything related to that, but I am just here to say that I want to see more people who look like me on my For You page, on my timeline. I want outfit advice. I want get ready with me's. I want tips and tricks for fashion from people who look like me, people I can relate to. And I may have to make a part two, but all this to say, please keep going. Please keep reassuring yourself that you will get to the point that you want to be because that's all I'm doing right now, honestly. Yeah, so that was basically the end of the video, but what he was saying about even being like a black content creator and how much harder it is to blow up, like 
oh my gosh like i am so sick and tired of seeing white content creators come on like tiktok and be like just stay consistent just keep posting just you know i blew up in like three months like <laughs> like uh, what, girl? like are you that like oh, i don't understand like are you that dense like and sometimes I'm very uncomfortable like bringing race into it because people will automatically say stop weaponizing your skin tone or or stop giving yourself an excuse and saying that your skin tone is the reason why blah blah blah. But realistically speaking, I'm going to speak for myself. I love the skin that I'm in. I love my dark skin. I never seen a pro I never had a problem with it. I never seen a problem with having or being dark skin, right? Okay. But as a society, you have things like colorism, you have things like texturism, and all these isms are feeding into people's minds and having people now judge others based off of whatever stereotype they have associated with a dark skin person, a light skin person, white person, etc. For me, when I'm looking for new creators to watch, I can 100% say that I don't discriminate. If you ask me the creators I watch, I can give you a range of different people, different races, different ages, different sexualities, all that. When I look for creators, when I look for like new content to watch, I'm not judging. I'm not seeing a thumbnail of a person who looks like whatever. And I'm not allowing whatever stereotype society has on them to get in the way of me watching their content or me supporting them as a content creator. As a dark skinned person, I can say, yeah, maybe the algorithm, there's a bias in the algorithm, blah, 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 blah. So when he's saying, you know, as a black creator, it's harder to blow up. For some reason, when you see his content versus a white creator's content, most likely in our society, somebody is gonna click on that white creator's content over his. It's just like that um, baby doll test when they had the baby dolls and like the children had to pick which doll was like appealing to them. They all chose the lighter doll because they thought it was prettier or they thought it was more appealing. So it's like when you know things like that actually happen in society, that can discourage you as a dark skinned girl to even put yourself out there because I can like myself all I want, but other people may not like me for whatever reason. And it's like, damn, I wish people would give me a chance type thing, you know? But I can only just continue and pray that the people who are meant to find me will find me. And I say this passionately because I know for me, I've had friends of all all kinds okay i have friends from different countries different races different ethnicities all that so it's just weird to me when people aren't as open you know but i mean that's not that's not something i can control i can only <laughs> continue and make content and you know and pray and hope to build a community that accepts me for me with bethany so sunny hi guys we're headed to the Ricks Hotel. Yeah. From so what it says online, it's so pretty. Yeah, so hopefully they allow us to take pictures. Um, How is your funk? My funk? Your funk gone. It's still there. That's why yeah. I, I don't like. But I was like, I mean, I didn't even want to have vlog. to try. Yeah, exactly. I told them, like, I did yeah. not. I, I had, had an option. <laughs> Bethany, when I tell you, I had to. All the outfits I was trying to put together yesterday, I was trying to. Um, I didn't do them because. Um, the heels that I had to wear, that means I had to repaint my toes and I did not feel like repainting my toes. Okay. So I, I based my outfits big on, based on closed toe shoes today. Cause that's how unmotivated I am right now. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I don't know what's in the freaking air. Like it's, but did you tell them how like every time you feel something? Yeah, I, I told also, them. Yeah, yeah, guys, I told them that. I think we're like in sync. Like what? <laughs> it's so weird. It's so weird. It's so weird. Like, ugh. I told them how we both even didn't feel like posting the other day. Yeah, I know. And it was like, no, we have to. Like, what the heck? And literally, with us? like, Akua literally texted me. She's like, you're late. I was like, okay, fine. <laughs> Maybe that was. Because she was not going to post. <laughs> no, because. No, because no. But I told myself that I have to, like, if I have a picture, I have to post. Unless yeah. there's actually something yeah. going on. Like, yeah. And I'm not mentally okay. Yeah. Like, consistency is what matters. Yeah. Whether I feel like it or not. So. Everything was okay at home. Everything was okay mentally. I was just, you know, yeah. whatever it is. Yeah. Go viral. Viral. You fucking for hours. hours. That pussy got power. That pussy got power. She wet in the shower. Wait. That pussy get loud. Loud. Wasting no power. 
Yeah. Wow. He fucking no cap. Y'all. We've been looking for parking for like 30 minutes. No, 30 minutes, literally. <laughs> Are you like, looking? Uh, Bethany, please. Wait, there's somebody behind me. Uh, and then they drive so close to me. Leave me alone. <gasps> We've been looking for parking for like literally 30 minutes and we keep circling the same block over and over and oh, over. You can't drive. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Uh, no, and every time we think somebody's leaving, they're going. They're actually just they're playing with us. Yeah, they're, they're fixing they think themselves. This is a joke. You can't like, fit. How can you can't fit? fit? He can't. You, you can't fit. Sorry. Like they, we can't fit. You can't fit there. Like, Sorry. And everybody tries. <laughs> That's the funniest part. <laughs> oh my god, I hate DC. No. Like, he, left. <laughs> he gave up. I'm Literally, fine. I cannot stand this place. Okay. Uh, you say straight, left or right? I'm gonna say left. My gut is telling left. me left. I don't know why. Okay, here we go. I don't know. Y'all, we'll update you if we find parking. I need one of y'all to have a baby. Um, nobody's having a baby, okay? I'm not ready for that. It's because y'all aren't thinking about me. What are you talking about? Then you have a child. <laughs> I don't have anybody to have a child with you. That can't, me. that doesn't stop you. We're you in are, 2022. You are, you are definitely closer to getting married than I am. What are you talking about? Everybody gets married at their own. People are younger. People are younger than me. But married. you need a man to get married. Uh, nah. You need somebody to get married. You have a man, so. They're closer. I'm, Technically. I am too immature to get married and to have a kid. I will literally take care of it for you. Seriously. No, you won't. I really will. No, you won't. Okay, what? Seriously. Totally think People it. always say this, and then when you have the kid and you need, hey, can you babysit? Oh, I'm out of town. Okay, just think oh, about it. Oh, I'm. No. What? It's a no, sorry. I don't need to think about it. I'm too selfish right now. I can't have a kid. They will hate me. <laughs> but me. Okay, then you have one. Go adopt one. There's okay, at first. Of okay, okay. To be, I know. They need to be adopted. I know. This girl is crazy. I know. No, I'm definitely going to adopt. I am. You're crazy. She said, go have a kid. I mean, I can barely provide food for myself. You want kids? Yeah. Oh, So, have it now. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, how many kids do you want? I want twins. Do they know this? No. You want twins? Mm hmm So, I want... you just want two? That's the thing. I want twins. But, but if you don't get twins, if I don't get twins, mm -hmm. I kind of want a big family just because I mean, I technically have a big family, but we're not close. I have a big separated family. I mm -hmm. want a big together family. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So I'm thinking, but I don't know. I don't pregnancy. It's a lot of work. I don't think I can do that multiple times. So honestly, I feel like two is fine. That's not a big family. What do you mean? That's like my family, except having a father in the house. That's just four. Two is two plus you the mom. Husband. Yeah, and that's the four. husband. Okay, then I got my cousins. They're gonna have kids. That's that. Um, you know what I mean? I mean your own family. That's that's big enough. Wait, do you know how many kids I want? You said five. You're crazy. I don't know how you say. How that's you gonna, a big family. How you gonna do that? How you gonna? Well, I have five names five for times? all. So oh, Jesus, I only have names. I have names. I have a boy name, and I don't have a girl name, but I have a boy name. So t I I don't know. So you seem prepared enough to me. No, you seem prepared. You have five. You know you want five. You know you have the names for all of them. You're crazy. It's in my notes. <laughs> I love them already. <laughs> but um, yeah, Queen's not having kids anytime soon. Thanks. No. I just need to beg her a little more. No. I'll get her. There, I'm guys. too selfish. I'll I get her there, guys. I look too good right now to be pregnant and swollen. Are you kidding me? Okay, think about some other things. No, I like my face. I like my body right now. We'll talk off camera about this. No. Are you kidding me? I'm crying. You I guys. swear the best times the camera is like it's off. The is off. Exactly. Like that's what I'm saying. Horry said like try to record everything. I'm like, bro, but it's, hard. it's yeah. hard. Like so. Ugh. While the camera was just off, we're strategizing what to do. I said if somebody asks us, we should just say. Cause these bags are so big. Like it's like if it's little bags, okay, fine. They're literally huge. So I was gonna say that we should just say that we're getting ready to book for the night, but we're just taking pictures before we check in our stuff, and we're in room two twelve. But <laughs> first she said first she said three twelve. I said what if they don't have a three twelve? She so said, said two twelve. They must have two floors. 
<laughs> no, they have to have at least two. I don't care. <laughs> then Aquia said that's like, they can't ask us what room that is. They can't. Y'all, let up? me know. I didn't make it up. Please let me know. Are hotel people allowed to ask you what room you're staying in? I feel like that's a breach in security. I mean, that because does, like, God forbid something happens to me and then you know my, you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so so when they ask it, I'm just saying mm, something security, what she said. Yeah, I, I don't feel comfortable sharing that information yeah, yeah. with you with all the, you know, human trafficking going and on. kidnapping and murdering. No, I'm not going to tell you what room I'm in. I'm going to pull a Karen. Yeah. Yeah. So, so um, wish us luck. I think, I think I told what Bethany do you think we, should do? we should just go in, go straight to the bathroom, feel it out, and then come back, like, when we're dressed and just take pictures i feel like going straight to the bathroom you act like you belong you know what i mean yeah hopefully the bathroom sign is just really big yeah but okay so you can pretend like you're on your phone or something yeah okay okay plan is done and hopefully you have a cute bathroom because yeah right? oh that would be so easy that would be so like easy you did, like you did no literally we last <laughs> last time we didn't vlog it but we went into this um dc dc DC. We, we didn't went, make eye contact with nobody. We went into the hotel. We didn't make no eye contact. We, I said, let's go straight to the bathroom. Yeah. When literally, I was like, as soon as we're going downstairs, I said, Bethany, I pray they have a cute bathroom. The because the lobby was like, bathroom. Mm. the lobby, like, the it, bathroom was cute. The bathroom was so cute. The couch. When I tell you, I almost passed out. I was like, oh my God, thank God. Because we were on our yeah. last and final outfit, and I did not feel like finding another place. So it's like, I just hope they have a cute bathroom. And they did. So hopefully, the couch, this. I just like, I feel like they should. That exactly. That couch was, bro. And it's in the bathroom? That's what I'm That's saying. It's a waste. Please put the, like, please. yeah. The couch. The couch is actually OC. But, yeah. um. Yeah, hopefully this bathroom. I, is nice. I think they will, because come on. It's really pretty. Yeah. When we're looking at pictures. Yeah. But okay, let's go. If you want to take pictures during the winter time, don't. <laughs> Literally, we walk to the, um. I don't know what I'm trying to say. We walk to the hotel. Ah! <laughs> I don't want to do it! You walk to the hotel, you walk inside the hotel, no type of lobby, just a cafe. Like, what kind of, like, architecture is no that? No type of lobby at all, and we went straight to the elevator, and then we <laughs> thought we could go up the um, elevator to go up to, like, to see if they have, like, you know, other lounge areas. Nope, the elevator, you have to have a key card. So we were just stuck in the elevator These fans <laughs> for a minute. These fancy hotels. No, literally. So now we're about to go somewhere else that we went to the other day with the nice couch that we were seeing earlier, and see if we can do it there. Literally. So we're in a new location, as you guys can see. That pretty couch that we were talking about, it's right there. <laughs> so we literally just walked straight into the hotel and we went straight to the bathroom because that's what we did last time. So we're just trying to see if we can get pictures in here first. So at least we have a solid picture. And if they see anything upstairs, so then we can just leave with a yeah. picture. Yeah, they can't. It's just the light. That's what I'm saying. We can take pictures. Yeah, but the light, bad light. But apparently people have something against the light. Yeah. Professional photography. Yeah, no, seriously. <laughs> Professional photography kiss my fat ass. <laughs> She used to be right there, and we moved it to block the bathroom. Shut the table. Shut the table. You used to be right next to the couch. That's cute. That one's over there. 
So here. Mm -hmm. We asked and they said no. <laughs> what we asked? She said, no, you can't take pictures here. Guys, I didn't even mention the light yet. <laughs> like that's what's killing me. I said, me and my friend want to take pictures. Is that allowed? She said no. <laughs> oh, God. Like I don't even have the energy to speak, literally. So we're back in the bathroom, and we're gonna see if we can make something work here. So, yeah. Again, to those of you who think content creation is easy, it's not. And we're like begin. I don't want to downplay this, you know. Mm -hmm. But we are like beginners. Imagine the ones who actually do this. You know? But it's easier when you get money. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I said I said it in my um, rant before. This is more motivating, I feel like. It's easy because you have the resources to book out anything you want. Anything, in any place. I mean, you don't have the resources to do that right now. It's hard because you have to rely on other people's establishments and yeah. stuff. And I understand that people have rules. Like, don't get me wrong, but it's like, yeah. Sometimes you just want it to work out in your favor. Yeah, Very humbling experience today. Yeah. I was telling Akuya, we've had like five good days in a row. Yeah. Where both of us have gotten like two yeah. pictures each. Yeah. So days like this are good sometimes. Yeah. You know, last time we had a day like this, the next weekend was crazy. Yeah. So. Okay. I guess now we'll try. Can you like contact, like just <laughs> DM us, okay? Cause we would love you. Yeah, cause these hotels, these hotels are we making up rules left and right. Right. <laughs> I think it would take a time to like just get realigned. Yeah. 
Because every weekend is when okay, pictures, pictures, yeah, pictures. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get realigned, chill, get realigned. Get back in the mood again. Yeah. Tell ourselves that we're pretty. Because if we, we, yeah, no, like I literally feel so ugly. I feel so ugly today. Like I'm even surprised I'm vlogging. Because I, <laughs> I'm not going to watch this. <laughs> I'm not going to watch this vlog. <laughs> I think what it is, is that like as we're starting off, we're just trying to make it as consistent as possible. Mm -hmm. But I was watching this video of this um, girl, she had her platform like really big mm -hmm. on like all social media, whatever. But she was saying like, as much as she tries to be consistent, she also like, thinks about when she needs to take like breaks. Break. Yeah. Yeah. So, breaks are important. Yeah. And if honestly if we were where we wanted to be, like at this moment, we I feel would, like we would take, take a break. Let's yeah. take a break. Yeah. But because we're not we're not if we were like pushing ourselves. Exactly. Then you burn out. Exactly. Yeah. We learned our lesson. Yeah. Well Y'all are gonna see us again this week. It's supposed to be a long ass vlog, but it's oh, okay. Shit. It's okay. Yeah, you'll you like see how we come back. Yeah, y'all yeah. will see how we come back. It's okay. Not I know y'all been and honestly, maybe some it's not even us. Maybe somebody put evil eye on us. Because I rebuke how? it in Jesus' name. Yeah. No, I rebuke it too. Because last week Bethany had a pimple here. This week I have a pimple here. Why it's in the same place? Why it's in the same place? Literally. Oh my god. Like that's the things like that freak me out. Like what the heck? Cause pimples are common, but like how we get in the same Thanks place? By. And then how come when you you feel some type of right, right? With which no, one? I need to pray tomorrow. Yeah. Right? We'll see. But yeah, if it was you comment down below. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but if y'all gonna see, we gonna bounce back. Don't let this discourage yeah. you. We have our bad days too. So. And I'm happy we finally look like we actually recorded. Yeah. The other day we weren't vlogging. Yeah. Either, yeah. But yeah. Today we ended up vlogging. Yeah. But my camera's overheating, so we're just gonna catch you guys. Bye. Bye. Say, ooh, stop it, ay. On my way to Bethany. Hey guys, so we're back to this. Currently picking up Bethany, and then we're gonna head off to the wharf in DC. It's currently like. 7 o'clock. I'm not even gonna hold you guys. I am not feeling myself. I don't like my makeup. I don't like my hair. Like, nothing is giving for me. I'll just let you guys know when we get there and let y'all know what's up. <laughs> guys, I think God just wants us to keep taking a break. Because, <laughs> because okay, you wanna explain? No words. Yeah, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, story time with us. So, I told you guys, what's today? Wednesday, right? Yeah. We, instead of doing Monday, we did Wednesday. So we're like, okay, like, we're gonna get right, whatever. So mentally, I'm okay, how are you? I'm okay. Good. So, Aquila picks me up. We're here. And then we were gonna go to the wharf in DC. But apparently, there's some, like, we should have vlogged it, or recorded it. Like, there was no parking in any of the garages because there's some, like, party festival. <laughs> Like, all the valet, like, literally no parking. So we're like, okay. I'm like, let me search up the nearest hotel. Or not nearest hotel, like, hotel, hotels in D.C. I'm like, okay, let's go to the Grand Hyatt. Whatever, Hyatt, Hyatt, whatever. Literally. It's okay, um, reverse a little bit. Oh, not somebody back there. The guy literally just pulled up behind us. But, can I get it? I don't know. Maybe you can zoom in. Can I? I feel like they're gonna kick us out. <laughs> is it getting it? Is it? But it's not focusing. No. Okay, yeah, it is. <laughs> okay, so Aqui's gonna show you guys and type it in what the sign says. But basically, no, I'm gonna read to you. Registered guests only beyond this point. You can't even use it for the bathroom. So Aquia, look, he's coming. Why don't you touch my window like that? It's Black History Month. <laughs> I, I need to find the directions. I'm, I'm about to leave. Why he knock my window like that? <laughs> yes, 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 no, don't play with me though. Did you see the way he did that? Boom. So if my window break, are you gonna fix it? Don't piss me off. The, it's no, Black History Month. It's Black History Month. Don't. So why me. why can't we just come in and take pictures? Let alone use the bathroom. Right. You know. There but was guys, Marriott. I'm gonna see. You think we should try there? Yeah. It's. Why did he just knock on your window? The way he did it, he wasn't even like a, he said, 
No, I hate when people mistreat my car some type of way, like valet or any. Cause who are you gonna pay? I think we're doing better this time around. We're not crying. The last time this I all happened, we cried. Yeah, I me think too. I'm just shocked because ain't yeah. no way. Okay. On a Wednesday, we're getting, we're getting, we're getting um tougher now. You know. On a Wednesday, bro. The ain't first no time way. we took a really fat L. Me and we both, we both teared up. Yeah. Literally. I think I teared up first, and then because I teared, now she started tearing. <laughs> yeah, oh no, God. no more tearing up. Clearly, everything happens for a reason. So I guess we try. Marriott. You want to try the Marriott? If not, we just take the L. Was it here? And go back to booking hotels. Because this don't make no sense to me. Oh, clear. That's one way. Akuya <laughs> 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 is trying to kill us today. <laughs> Please! Uh, how do I get over there? Is this one way? Oh yeah, you can't go that way. Dang! Is it one I way? I hate DC. Yeah, you can't go over there. Oh wait. No, it's not one way. Then why do they have the no turn inside? Oh, no. That, I don't know. Do not enter a queer. So where am I turn supposed to go? Oh. <laughs> you know what? I don't like this Blog. damn city. Or whatever, town, whatever. Two hours in a day! What is 1300? Well, but we can't take three L's in a day. That just in a row. I mean, that don't make no sense. So the next time we pick up this camera or the next footage is going to be good news, right, Aquia? It has to be. Yeah, because that's the only thing that makes sense to me. God, do we do something? No, honestly. You think oh, it's Black right? History Month? It's Black History Month. Ain't no way. It's a Valentine's Day weekend. This is my Valentine, my one and only lover. Oh my God. Wait, what? just watch the video. Did you say that about me? <laughs> so we're back. The Power Rangers. We're back. No, so this vlog is <gasps> gonna be continuing from our bad, bad day. Bad day. Yeah. We prayed in the car. Yeah. So we're back. We booked the hotel, as you guys can see. Mm -hmm. And we're about to take pictures for Valentine's Day and like other content because last week y'all saw was a mess. So, twice. <laughs> twice. So hopefully we get really bomb pictures, you guys. And we called this time. We called, Bethany called the hotel and asked them, can we take pictures? You said the, about the light thing too, right? Girl, I told them everything. <laughs> and if, if somebody tries to say something, you know how they'd be like, oh, like yeah. we're recording this call. Yeah. I'm going to say, okay, find the recording <laughs> of the conversation. <laughs> because I called. No, literally. And I was like, yeah, like no yeah. problem. So I said, Okay, are you sure? And I literally yeah. repeated it. Yeah. Because, uh, no. Yeah. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so hopefully everything goes well. Um, the will. hotel we booked is pretty nice, um, the, the spa. So we're about to get ready and take pictures. And y'all just gonna see the outfits. We, we'll come back on camera when we, when the we outfits. Out. Yeah. Please, we're going viral, okay? Please. Me and the queer are really better change our lives. No, honestly. <laughs> I'm telling you guys now. Honestly, who's doing it like us locally? Micro influencer, almost to macro influence. Who's doing it like <laughs> us? We're investing, babes. Okay, no, serious. we're investing in our. Let me tell you this they may call you crazy, and <laughs> they may call you crazy in the beginning, right? But once we actually change our lives up, right. people may look at you like, What the hell is wrong with these girls? There's actually a lot wrong with this though. Yeah, there is. I'm not gonna hold you. I'm just glad I found my equal. Someone who does the most for pictures. Girl, what? Because in my... Oh, and we were literally talking about in the car. Somebody yeah. who cares about my pictures, yeah. like I care about yeah. theirs. Yeah. Because so many people, like, they want the best for themselves. Right. And then when it's time for yours, it's like... It's like, like all right. Literally half... All right. Half, you know. You know. <laughs> I'm trying to not curse as much on Bethany's channel. Like a couple influencers, they oh. stayed at this bomb ass hotel, and I was like, to take pictures and do just what? to like live, just to like, <laughs> just to like do stuff. A gift. Like, yeah. And I was just like, it's like a retreat type thing. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, just wait, wait, just wait for me every time. Yeah. <laughs> just wait. <laughs> Nothing less. No, like literally. Guys, this wig be so big. 
all these wigs, look. I can't like turn my head. You have the same problem. <laughs> cause my head Literally. Is so small. I think um the um one of the um Isaac he comments because I, I was talking oh, about the wig flap. He was like, not the wig flap. I was like, listen, it's I'm literally not a flap. Like, like if I go like it's this, literally, bro. I know y'all seen it this whole vlog. I don't even really care. There's pictures on my Instagram. The wig flap <laughs> it was showing. Y'all just didn't know it was showing. Ah! I wasn't recording. I just recorded this whole hoopla about my outfit, feeling myself, and I'm not gonna do it again because that's not organic. But just know I'm feeling myself in this outfit, okay? Thank you. <laughs> like, I literally just was talking about how. Uh, you know what? It's okay. No, Aquia was definitely talking for like five plus minutes. Yeah, and it wasn't recording. Like, what the heck? But basically, we put on our outfits. It's giving Tinkerbell. Cute little Tinkerbell. It's giving. I don't rich, know. Bougie. Rich auntie. Auntie. That's what it's giving. Yeah. I wish I could dress like this. Oh, oh and saying. she mentioned that she stole. Oh yeah, her mom. I stole my. I stole this from my mom. So mom, yeah. if you're watching, thanks. I don't buy jewelry. I just stole it from my mom. Um, <laughs> what was I saying? Oh, I was saying I don't dress like this often. Okay, this is how I aspire to dress like. And it will happen. And it will happen in the future. I just I don't be having anywhere to go, so I can't dress like this. But um, yeah, me and Bethany are gonna. I have this video idea in my head that i want us to do and i hope it goes viral i pray it goes viral because i feel like it will go viral like it just i just feel like we oh, yeah, has been saying we're no, going viral we're going by like by force times. by fire we're going viral like it just like because i feel like we look good and we take pictures all the time but this is completely different you know what i mean yeah so i just feel like it has i didn't to. never had bright hair like yeah this yeah and i just i just basic like what the heck what is this? I, I don't just like this. Anyways, but um, yeah. So it has to go viral. <laughs> it has to go viral. <laughs> viral, viral, viral. Miss Booked and Busy over here has like videos to film. So we're just gonna do that and then get ready. Well, finish getting ready and then take our pictures. But I just wanted to show you guys how I look like before I take pictures because it's giving. Oh, I didn't check my shoes. These are my shoes. They're extra. They're also like similar color to this. I know it's a lot, but I don't care. I literally do not care. But um, yeah. Once a year, you know, you have to pop off a bit. Remind the girls. But I will see you guys when we take pictures. Bye. Y'all, these hotels be catfishing. All right, let me tell you something. It's okay though. We're gonna make it work as we always do. But it's okay. Aquia's gonna try. We like move stuff around. So Aquia's gonna try that couch right there. Right, I said couch. That chair right there. You wanna do standing or? Um, yeah, I'm gonna do standing and sitting. Like I'm gonna do like, like standing. Oh, that's cute. Okay, yeah, I think sitting. move it this way because I don't want the vent thing to be in it. Oh. And I need to move all of this. Yeah. You said move it this way. This way. This way? Yeah. Okay. Cause the vent in it would be ugly. Yeah, that's cute. That's cute. Okay. We're about to start taking pictures. The lobby wasn't working out for at least for this these outfits. Um, we want it to be like really, you know, can't we want to stand. Yeah, we want to stand. Like, we're tired of sitting. <laughs> like if you peep all our pictures, most. <laughs> if you know it's sitting, we just had to do that because it wasn't our choice. Yeah. But um, yeah. So we're gonna try it in the room. Hopefully, it looks good. It will look good. It will look good, yeah. By right. force. But yeah. It's the color of the couch, too. <laughs> you worked. <laughs> oh, cool. This looks good. You look rich. <laughs> I'm going to try sitting first. Ah! Oh, sit back and, like, put your feet up. Yeah. Oh, this is so hot. Make a You just wanna party, you just wanna lap dance, you just wanna pop up on these times like you the Batman. You just wanna butt up in the sun with your best friends. You don't wanna talk no more about it in the past. Oh my god! No, I'm just talking come from shoddy. I ain't give you nothing, you got come from shoddy. I got plenty things you make up on for shoddy. Got a bed shit when he and laugh with my body.
Oh. I was like, what is that? Oof. And I had to get out of her picture. She won't fuck on the day. Head to start, get some purse for this lady. We go CC, make her wanna go crazy. I hit Mercedes inside of Mercedes. How would that P got you popping in places? I'm giving that a D on the D button, baby. I'm giving that a D on the D button, baby. I'm in a gut like to sit up. I drop the dig out like a dealer. Yeah, I left a few rest for your rent up. She made that little pussy pop like a pimple. I'm poking my hand in the center. Yeah, I tell her, pull up, she gon' mop out the dribble. That's why I upgraded her denture. And I'm mob in love with you. She wanna go viral. We fucking for hours. hours. That pussy got power. That pussy got power. She wet in the shower. We that pussy get loud. Now we say no power. We fucking no cow. No, I dig in it deep. She wanna get geek. Oh, she stepping that flower. He geeking for hours. Okay, next outfit. Players are players. They peek it devout. To my brother, she owls. She owls. I'm coming, my baby. Forget a crocodile burger, my baby. Show you a lick, now you working, my baby. You fuck on me and feel personal, baby. Trust me, it's coming full circle, my baby. The dash in the bands is virtual, baby. You seeing 3D off of Perky, my baby. Seeing HD off the two shit, my baby. 31 gang get spooky, my baby. How can I worry about blocking with buttons when they. Are you dumb or stupid? This is out here in Glock, this is busting. How can I not be the topic discussion when niggas got rich off a drop of my buddy? How do you even be rocking with buddy? The pictures I see. It's girl. If you're out there and you're taking content on content day, remember to eat. Don't be like me and Bethany who forget to eat and then we're taking pictures and then we're, all, we're about to pass out because we don't eat. So I'm literally trying to down this clementine or tangerine or whatever it is before I not pass out. But we're on our second outfits. Are you, are you talking to them? Yeah, I was telling them they need to eat and not be like us because we don't eat. Let me know if this is disrespectful, but. So I'm about to cut the handles off of this bag because it just, I just don't like it, okay? I like the bag, I love the color, but this, like everybody knows, this joint is too long. Like, who's wearing it like this? I don't even wear bags like this, you know? So I'm just gonna cut it. <laughs> You know, I hope this is not disrespectful, <laughs> but I'm just going to cut it because I, I just can't. It bothers me. It really bothers me. Here goes nothing. <gasps> okay. I just, I can't do it. I can't do with the long ass string or handle. If I like it, I'll sew it back. I know how to sew. Okay. Ooh, yeah. This is so much better. Like what, are you kidding? Like, this is so much better. <laughs> Please. I know this is, this is probably disrespectful to him. Cause he designed this, you know, with his hopes and dreams and visions in this bag. But hey, sometimes uh, your consumers won't like it. And that's just me. Listen, 
It's a huge bag, but mm -mm, them handles gotta go. It's too long. DC Woody look like much better. You can't tell me like what? Take it from him and not leave him with nothing. She wanna go viral. Viral. We fucking for hours. Ow. That pussy got power. That pussy got power. She wet in the shower. Wait, that pussy get loud. Now, we say no power. Wow. He fucking no cow. Nope, that dick getting deep. deep. He wanna get geek. Oh, she's stepping that flower. Wow. He geeking for hours. The player's a player. They peek at the bow. To my brother, she owls. She owls. Shleddy. Fit. I know, right? Third and final fit. This is me. Um, so this I didn't even show you tell y'all where my outfit's from. I'm so sorry. Oh my god. But um pants are from Boohoo. Bodysuit is from Boohoo. Jewelry, my mom. <laughs> Libra necklace, fashion nova, it's fake jewelry. This is supposed to be sage green, but it looks white on camera, so hopefully um, it doesn't look that off. But yeah, that's Bethany talking. It's her vlog. Make sure you watch her vlog. And like and subscribe. And like and subscribe to me because yeah. <laughs> but um, we're about to go down to the lobby and take our third photos. And after that, we're going to come back up and I'm going to force her to get our videos because I stamp. I'm not leaving this hotel without the videos. So, yeah. Me Yes. Are you done talking? Yes. Okay, come. Okay. <laughs> third outfit. Period. So cute. I look like um, a woman. Yeah. Because I am. <laughs> we're almost there. We're pushing through. Literally, we both got two. Yeah, that's good. Which is really good. Yeah, in a short amount of time. Yeah, I told them we're not leaving without our videos. Yes. Okay. Thank you. So. Yes. We're about to head out. See you. We love you. Make a You just wanna party. You just wanna lap dance. You just wanna pop up on these clowns like you the Batman. You just wanna butt up in the sauna with your best friends. You don't wanna talk no more about it in the past. Get me out my zone. I'm just talking. Shoddy. I ain't give you nothing, you got come for shoddy I got plenty days, you make a run for shoddy Got that bitch shit when he in love with my body vlog and she was telling you guys not to give up give up if you guys are content creators because at the beginning of this video <laughs> you guys saw literally we were on the verge L. of crying right yeah don't give up yeah. everything happens for a reason yeah. push through yeah you got this yeah. literally you guys saw us taking l's in the beginning like two weeks ago and now we're back we got three pictures we got videos we got tiktoks we got everything even though it's late and we're tired as hell we got we got it done so i'm it. proud of us and we're yeah like she said it's all worth it so we're about to like you know 
get ready to go to bed, get something to eat because we have not eaten early anything our all day. Is down, it's yeah, good. it's We're literally tired. 3 a.m. So if our energy is like here, like my eyes are closing. So yeah, but thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Um, stay subscribe. tuned. Yeah, subscribe. Stay tuned to the next vlog. My arm is hurting. I'm about to drop this camera. Okay. Bye. 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 See you guys in the next one. Bye. I love you.